Is the statement as the amount of cyanogen used in the Mississippi River drainage basin increased, the load of that herbicide in the Mississippi River always increased supported by figure 2? Now we can see that there are a few strong keywords out here which may, which is always increased and the as the amount of cyanogen used in the Mississippi River increased. So we are looking at a very strong relationship. So if even if one value breaks the relationship, uh, we can safely say that this statement is wrong. We look at the amount of herbicide used in Mississippi River, which has the least. Uh, the load of herbicide in Mississippi River is uh, between 50 to 100, nearing 100. And the trend is generally increasing. However, there's one anomaly out here. Between 10,000 to 15,000, the load of herbicide has been has has its lowest, which is at 50. And this actually breaks the statement. So we ignore F, G. Let's look at H and J. It states that the load of herbicide decreased only, which is not true because it sometimes did increase as well. So we're left with only option J.